Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's episode, I'm going to show you how we can create thunderstorm using the Unity particle system. So let's get started. Start by creating a new particle system and rename it to thunderstorm underscore particle system. Reset its transform, set the max particle size to three and after that set the y position to 100 set pre-warm and start life would be 5 start speed would be 0.2 start size would be random between two constants and the values would be a hundred and a 300 okay after that Rotation, start rotation would be random between two constants and the values will be minus 360 to 360. Okay. Okay, now the start color would be a bit of a light blue kind of color like this and set its opacity to lowest like this okay maybe grayish light blue let's see we'll change this later on set the emission to 40 and uh, shape would be a box and its scale would be 500 by 500 okay that's how clouds will look in the sky you can raise it above a little bit okay but it's not done we have something else to do set the color of a lifetime to something like this set these ones to zero okay after that change size of a lifetime do something like this the keyframe here drag it above like this okay this is like this okay set the render to horizontal billboard this is how it will look above in the sky now we need a cloud texture so go to photoshop create a new file of size 512 by 512 okay paint the background paint the background with black create a new layer create a brush tool select the brush tool set the brush color to white and make sure the opacity is low and paint it paint a cloud a random cloud like this one after that pick a razor and make sure its opacity is like this move it like this increase the size of your brush and like this then again use the brush and paint it like this hide the background and save it as a png and rename it to cloud import your cloud into your unity project and uh, check alpha is transparency create a new material rename it to cloud underscore matte set the shader to legacy shader particles alpha blended drag and drop your cloud drag and drop your material onto your thunderstorm okay after that now duplicate your thunderstorm make it a child of this one duplicate your cloud effect and change its shader to legacy shaders particles additive drag and drop this one here okay now set the y position to minus one 
and uh, lifetime would be random between two constants and the values will be 0 0.2 and 0 0.5 okay so these are really looking like thunderstorms this color would be a bit of a darker blue and let's change this lighter blue as well I really don't like it this one is better or this one okay looks better go back to this one this blue should be a bit like okay much better now check force over lifetime and set random between two constants and set the y values to minus 0 0.5 and minus 0 0.7 and the space would be local so that's it that's how we create a thunderstorm effect using the unity particle system i hope you enjoyed the tutorial make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our youtube channel for more videos if you want to see a vfx effect tutorial of your choice let us know in the comments we will see you in a new video goodbye